What's up, guys? We are here, Norman and I are here at uh, 24 hour. We are uh, getting some shoulders in. We are doing a little bit of rear delts right now, and I just came across an awesome machine. It is a, uh, just a regular machine fly for rear delt or chest fly, but it's a little longer. I'm a little too short to use this one, so we're modifying it with a single arm. But I kind of want to show you the way we're doing it to really target the rear deltoid. So it's awesome for a great stretch and a good contraction. So I'm going to do my first set. Norman's going to film me, and then I'm going to have her jump on, and I'm going to kind of break it down for form and technique to you guys. So this is a set two for me. So you're not going to go too heavy. Make sure you pick a weight that you control because we're really trying to isolate the Verdell. It's very easy to use your back, your trap when you're doing uh, Verdell exercises. So the concentration exercise really focus on using the right muscles. I'm going to sit perpendicular to the bench, feet together. Put your hand up here for stabilization. You really want to stretch the delt. Keep your elbow high, shoulder height, and you want to pull back. Stretch across. We focus on stretching the muscle here and squeeze it. You don't want to pull her elbow back too far. She's going to get the trap involved. She's dressing her elbow. It's crazy. I'm going to superset this with a face pull. I have to go see it so I go a little heavier, better balance. So you guys, rear delt is one of those muscles that's very hard to, to concentrate on. A lot of people use, like I said, their traps, their back when they're pulling. So don't go too heavy on these exercises. Focus on stretching and focus on squeezing the muscle. Every time you guys come out, make sure you feel the muscle elongate. And that way you'll know you're on the right muscle and you're contracting. Good, as you can see, she's gonna leave with her elbow and she's gonna pull back. Do we wanna eliminate any trap activation so right to there the moment you see her trap start to rise it's taking over so she needs to bend up a little more she comes back go across your face and leave the elbow pull the elbow good drop the trap pull elbow high there you go right there this is the muscle we're training good stretch it and squeeze right there good other side. Look. See how the elbow stays high? Pulling up and across. Stretching the rear delt. Leading with the elbow and squeezing. Not pulling too far where the trap takes over. But just enough for the full contraction of the rear delt. Got it. Elbow staying elevated. This exercise guys with the other lifts as well so you guys are having problem getting your rear delts to grow prioritize them so start your workout with rear delts that way you're getting these muscles to fire and that way when you're doing your other exercises those muscles will already be in the mind muscle connection already so you guys will be firing those muscles and they'll be able to support the other lifts as well so that's some of the things i like to do for rear delts uh, i started rear delts a lot last year and that's why i felt brought them up um, 
like this exercise that we just did on the reverse uh, chest fly, the high pulls, um, and bent over rear flies are some of my favorite exercises. So if you guys got any questions, I'm gonna be on here for a few more minutes before we wrap up the workout. We're probably gonna jump into, what do you wanna do next? You wanna do a machine press or do you wanna do a dumbbell press? Or uh, more, more laterals? Presses. Presses, dumbbell. So let's do like a, like a, a dumbbell press here and then a press on the face again. No, you got, you guys are all, we're all done. Go ahead. Awesome guys, well, we appreciate your support. We're gonna be going live more, a lot more frequently. I think this is our third video now, but um, we appreciate your feedback. So any questions you guys have or anything you guys wanna know or have me do a Q and A on, let me know because this is the time of the year where I really get to focus on uh, putting out a lot of information to you guys. So um, appreciate your feedback, appreciate your support. We'll see you guys soon.